Good afternoon. This is the National Weather Service in Anchorage, Alaska with Tuesday's Alaska statewide weather. Low pressure moving into the Gulf of Alaska brought uh, rain to the southeast coast with gusty southeast winds today. Two-thirds of an inch of precipitation fell during the day today at Haines and Sitka while Cake picked up three-quarters of an inch of rainfall. To the west, northwest winds gusted to 46 miles per hour at Kodiak State Airport and winds were on the increase across uh, western Cook Inlet to the Alaska Range through the passes out of the northwest as well. Otherwise, a weak trough brought areas of light snow into the southwest part of the state, extending northward to the western Arctic coast, and another system is spreading into the northwest Bering Sea. That front will push into the coast tonight and produce uh, areas of gusty winds with snow, localized blowing and drifting snow along the entire west coast down to Kuskokwim Bay as Bristol Bay remains dry and winds diminish, continue to diminish along the Alaska Peninsula. Look for increasing chances of snow for northern Cook Inlet into the Manuska Valley northward to the central Alaska Range and look for periods of rain and snow for the North Gulf Coast. And uh, conditions will gradually improve for the Panhandle, but precipitation won't end completely as another trough will keep it wet and unsettled there through Wednesday. And that also goes for the North Gulf Coast with periods of snow from Cordova westward into northern Cook Inlet and the Manuska and Susitna Valley. And the northern Seward Peninsula, Prince William Sound, will see periods of snow. And again, over the western and northern Copper River Basin, low pressure will uh, push another round of gusty winds and snow into the western part of the state Wednesday afternoon.